welcome to let's crack neat pg the youtube channel for an academy our neat pg division and uh, here you'll find the top educators quality content and you are assured a great learning experience so my name is chatanna mittal i'm currently pursuing my mbbs from aims new delhi and uh, i hope you've already downloaded the an academy learning app in case you haven't done that please go to the play store download the app and you will have to register with your mobile number then set your goal as neat pg to access mbbs courses and after that you will need an invite code to unlock the free plan so you can use my invite code chatanya10 and get a 10% off on your plus subscriptions and you can also unlock the free content all right so these are some of the top educators who are teaching live on an academy and you can follow them there right and educators are supposed to make plus courses for all of you right so these plus courses are obviously paid courses and you will need a subscription to access them but to show you what the live experience feels like we have free of cost special classes available on the platform so even if you don't take a plus subscription take maximum advantages of the free content that are being made by all these plus educators so there are batch courses that are running these are basically live classroom courses so these are live batch courses that you can watch and they will give you the live classroom experience if you want to assess your preparation there is an option for testing we have special tests and weekly tests right and if you have any doubts we have a doubt clearing feature now that is called an ask a doubt feature right so take advantage of all these three kinds of things and with this your preparation will become one stop with an academy right so everything here is going to be covered and we have the upcoming batches for neat pg for next for fmge and for inict so all kinds of batches we have so if you are preparing for any of these entrance examinations or if you are an mbbs student or if you are a student studying for bds or ayurveda or homeopathy and you feel that these classes are helping you take advantage of whatever you can right and uh, free tests are there for you to assess your preparation so that you can compete with a uh, lot of aspirants for the examination and that makes an academy the easiest way to learn for neat pg online we are giving you flexibility in terms of your schedule when you want to learn what you want to learn in terms of the language you can learn in english you can learn in hindi you can even learn in your regional languages and you can watch the videos as many times you want you can attempt the quizzes as many times as you want so just go ahead and install the application take advantage of the chat feature there take advantage of the polls which will help you compete in live quizzes and you are basically having the ability to learn anytime anywhere you want so there are two kinds of subscriptions there is an unacademy plus subscription and there is an unacademy iconic subscription in the unacademy plus subscription you get access to the entire live experience that is the live classes the live tests and live quizzes the batch courses and you are getting access to a structured schedule which will help you streamline your preparation okay and i already told you that the tests feature and the doubts feature make an academy a one stop unique solution for your neat pg preparation as far as the iconic subscription is concerned you not only get access to an academy but you also get access to our premium partner that is prep ladder which we have recently acquired and as you all know prep ladder is having premium video lectures for select topics question banks which are updated according to the latest pattern a rapid revision course and the handwritten notes and if you use these handwritten notes it will be very easy for you to make your notes especially if you are towards the end of your preparation it will be very easy for you to compile all your preparation in one place right so all of these notes are printed hand colored and if you buy them separately they'll cost you 7000 okay so the iconic subscription for one year will cost you 55000 and if you just simply apply the referral code chatanya10 this will give you a discount of 10% and this will cost you 49500 you can also take the two year plan that costs you 69300 and the three year plan will cost you cost you 82800 if you take the unacademy plus subscription the one year plan is for 25000 and the two year plan it is for 36000 and you can take the 3 year plan for 45000 all you have to do is use the referral code chatanya10 and again you are getting a 10% off remember this referral code is applicable for any kind of course that you purchase whether it be for neat pg or whether you are preparing us uh, 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 taking a subscription for someone in your family preparing for neat ug or upsc this is valid okay so this is how you have to take the subscription just choose the plan and you can apply the referral code you have to enter my referral code and click on apply and you can also apply credits for an additional discount right so that was about the an academy subscription so now let's move on to today's video so in this video we are going to talk about a rare metabolic disorder known as tarui disease right t a r u i tarui disease so here what is the uh, pathophysiology and what is the causation of this disease we'll discuss that but before we go into the name into the details of what um, this disease is let's try and understand what 
other names could be written for this particular disease it is also called as it is also called as phosphofructokinase deficiency and that gives you an idea of the defect in this particular disease and it can also be written as glycogen storage disorder sorry glycogen glycogen storage disorder type Type 7, right? It is glycogen storage disorder type 7. So it's very important to know what are the various types of glycogen storage diseases. So this one is glycogen storage disease type 7, right? So those can be the other alternative names that you might see for Tarui disease. So Tarui disease or glycogen storage disease type 7 or PFK deficiency. So before we talk about this disease, we'll have to talk a little bit about the structure of phosphofructokinase. So I hope you remember how the LDH or the lactate dehydrogenase enzyme is. It is a tetrameric molecule, right? It is a tetrameric molecule. So this also, just like that, is also a tetrameric molecule. So there are four subunits to phosphofructokinase. There are four subunits to phosphofructokinase and they are all arranged together and they have various combinations depending on their location just like LDH it's very very similar to what you do in LDH1, LDH2, LDH3, LDH4, LDH5 all of that right so if I tell you phosphofructokinase there are possible subunits mainly there are two but these days we write them as three EFKL, EFKM so this is, there is an L subunit there is an M subunit and there is also said to be a P subunit okay there are three subunits L here stands for liver M here stands for muscle and P here stands for platelet. So they will be present, phosphofructokinase will be present in all tissues but depending on where it is present, the combinations of the subunits, they will vary. Okay, so one important point that you have to know is RBCs, they have both subunits, L subunit also and M subunit also, L subunit also and M subunit also. So for example, if I if I take hypothetically, let's say the liver form of liver, iso, uh, uh, liver isoenzyme of phosphofructokinase, it will have uh, all subunits as L. Let's say it has all subunits as L. Now, let's say you go to the RBC. In the RBC, you will see that both L and M both are present. Let's say you go to the muscle. There you will see that both all subunits are actually M. So that might be what your observation is. Okay, so I'm talking about this hypothetically, but uh, that is what you have to understand. So the defect here, the defect here in Tarawi disease, it is an autosomal recessive disorder. And what happens here is that there is a deficiency of subunit M. Subunit M is not present. Okay, subunit M is not present and that is the disorder. That is the disorder in case of Tarui disease. So, in this disorder, the, the, the defect is because of, because of, this is a genetic defect and in that the subunit PFKM, M subunit is missing. So, there will be a problem with the muscle because the M subunit is present mainly in the muscle. So, you will have a problem in the skeletal muscle cells, right? So, besides the problem in the skeletal muscle cells, the other kinds of cells that will be affected will be the RBCs. The other kinds of cells that will be affected will be the RBCs. So, if you look at the muscle, if you look at the muscle, there will be cramping, right? The person will get fatigued with exercise, right? There will be fatigue with exercise. And because the RBCs, they rely solely on glycolysis as their energy source, the RBCs will not be able to carry out glycolysis and that will lead to death of RBC. So therefore, there will be hemolysis. Therefore, there will be hemolysis. So that is the characteristic finding of Tarui disease. So you can have, um, so you can have uh, myopathy, you can have weakness. And because there is damage to the muscle, there is damage to the muscle so you will have myoglobinuria you will have myoglobinuria because the muscles are also breaking down so you can write here myoglobin that's another thing to be uh, that's another thing that you should be considering here so another thing will be hyperuricemia because your kidney will not be able to process the uric acid because of damage due to the myoglobin and that is more commonly seen in the children right and um, you can also have high levels of bilirubin because uh, this is there's there's hemolysis that's going on and because of that levels of bilirubin will be high so the person might also appear jaundiced okay so we have kind of um, given i'm giving you all the uh, clinical presentations for thyroid disease and what are the various keywords that you can use to identify that on an mcq right so thank you so much for watching and uh,
be ending the class. Right. So thank you so much for watching the video, and uh, I'm really thankful that you guys spent your time on uh, uh, on today to watch this video. And do remember to hit the like button if you guys like this video. That's a, a really powerful motivation for any educator. And do drop a comment. That's an even more powerful motivation. And for your benefit, do remember to subscribe to the channel. Let's crack NEET PG. And you will get access to all subjects that are being made. And we are giving you the live classroom experience on YouTube. Okay. And you can also subscribe to our Telegram channel. The link of the Telegram channel is also in the description. It's with the same name. So faculty keep updating their uh, various lectures here. So stay subscribed to that also. And do track what is uh, the content that is coming on a particular day. So these are the referral codes, Chaitanya 10. You can use this to unlock free plan, right? You can use this to unlock a free plan or you can also use this to purchase a subscription. You will get a 10% off on your subscriptions. And do remember to hit the bell icon for notifications. Okay. Thank you so much, guys.